Good morning everyone. Today I am coming to you with a much requested video. I've had quite a few questions about my skincare regimen, the beauty products that I use, and what I do to my hair. So if you're interested, stick around. apply any makeup I do want to talk to you guys about skincare I have always been just you know obsessed with skincare and taking care of my skin now when I was younger when I was a teenager and in my 20s and even my early 30s I am guilty that I would just go out into the Sun and just bake myself <laughs> and uh, but I no longer do that I have learned um, from my wicked ways but I just I feel like you know you cannot look your best if you don't take care of the canvas so I feel like our skin needs to be in tip-top shape I think that it's so important to take care of our skin to cleanse our faces before we go to bed at night and I have just always been adamant about taking care of my skin I have tried many um, beauty products and skincare products in the past but I finally found something that works for me and it is pricey but it is so worth it and I don't know if you guys are familiar with Skin Medica but I get this at uh, my uh, dermatologist office and the Skin Medica line is the best that I've ever used. And there was a while there that I thought, you know, I really don't need to spend this much on these products because I believe this is called the Skin Medica TNS Essential Serum. And you can find all kinds of videos on YouTube about this. Now, um, I, you know, I used it for about a year and I absolutely loved it and I could see a huge improvement in my skin but then after a while you know I thought I just don't need to spend this much money I think that I could go without it and when I stopped using it you guys I could tell a huge difference my face started looking dull again you know and I just didn't have that glow this stuff is worth its weight in gold I'm telling you I could not live without it now it probably I think the price is about two hundred and seventy eight dollars a bottle and they suggest that you use it morning and night, but I don't do that. I use it uh, every night, and sometimes I even skip a night. But if you use this regularly, I would say if you use it, you know, maybe five times a week, you will see a huge, huge improvement in your skin, and it does not take much. There are other products in the Skin Medica line that I use, and I have quite a few here, but I will go over the top products that I use. Okay, so I am a firm believer in using a retinol complex, and I have, um, okay, let's see. I have the retinol complex 0 0.5 and 1.0. And I, I normally use the 0.5. The 1.0 is a bit uh, strong for my skin. My skin is in very good condition. It's very healthy. And uh, I really don't need this strength. So I normally uh, use the 0.5 and I use it every other night. I don't use it every night. Again, they do suggest to use this every night, but I don't feel like I need it. But I do use it at least five times a week. Um, you know if not less so this is a wonderful product and when you put it on your skin you can instantly see a glow coming through I mean a glow from within so this is a must-have in the skin medical line for me another must-have and I use this particular product under my makeup because I can't put too much moisturizer on and then put my makeup over it because my makeup just wants to slide right off my face but I find that this product works well for me and it is the Skin Medica uh, vitamin C and E complex and it's very very light and um, when you put it on your skin you don't need much just a little bit of it and it just glides on your skin I mean it just one little drop 
will practically cover your entire face. So I just put a little dot here and there and the it just glides. I mean, my skin, it just feels like, I don't know, it's just so smooth and almost glass-like. And then when you, uh, I let it, you know, seep into my skin for a good, you know, 30 seconds before I put my primer on. And uh, again, I let that um, go into my skin. I wait about 30 seconds be before each application of product. But this uh, vitamin C E complex just glides on your skin. And I find this the perfect under makeup. Uh, product because my makeup goes on just effortlessly and it looks so smooth and I cannot live without this product and I believe this will run you about $98. Of course one of the most important things you can do for your skin is protect it from the sun so always use an SPF sunscreen under your makeup and I really like the Skin Medica sunscreen because it does not have a strong smell. That was always my problem in the past. I just can't stand that sunscreen smell and especially, you know, on my face, but um, it's very, it's very light and very creamy, like a moisturizer. And it does not, it does not have a strong smell. So I always uh, put on the vitamin C E complex and then I put the sunscreen on. Moving along, a few other products that I love from this line. I do love their moisturizer and this is their rejuvenative, it's hard to say, uh, moisturizer and I'm just about out of it. It runs you about $56 but this has lasted me for a really, really long time. It, Like I said, all of these products are so highly concentrated it only takes just a few drops and so a little drop like that will uh, moisturize your entire face so um, I oh it's it's so creamy so rich and it leaves your skin feeling so refreshed and dewy and I love this moisturizer. Now I have recently come across another moisturizer that I absolutely have fallen in love with and it is, you've probably heard of it, the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream. And I have um, come really close to the bottom of the jar. I've got another order on the way. I love this stuff and this, you know, you don't have to get this from your doctor's office but this is just, Oh my goodness, I have fallen in love with this stuff so much so that I have ordered the night cream. So I'll let you guys know how I feel about that. But this, um, you can get this at Nordstrom and this is a 50 ml uh, size and it will run you $100. You know, good skincare is just not cheap and I have tried, I have tried so many times to find something that was, you know, less expensive but I always feel like my skin pays the price. So the good thing about really good products, despite the price, that's the only con of course, is it only takes a small drop. You do not have to use a lot of it and it, it does last a really long time. So this is another great moisturizer. I tend to alternate between these two moisturizers and I think I've had this, um, I've probably had this about six weeks and I'm just now uh, ordering another one. So this has lasted quite a long time. I have one other product and I don't uh, use it as religiously as I do all the others. And this is the HA5 and it is a hydrolonic acid and it's supposed to promote uh, dermal skin health, of course, and brighten your skin. I should probably use this one more, but um, this one is very lightweight, and you can get these products. They come in bundles, or you can order them in bundles. Like, you can do, um, look on the website. You can see where you can get the TNS, the HA5, and a moisturizer. And you know, you get a better price that way. But also, I wanted to tell you guys that the good thing about these products, you can um, sign up for Brilliant Distinctions. It's a program. And every time 
that you order these products, you get points. And I, I have a uh, $10 voucher now, and I'm almost out of my vitamin C and E complex. So it just depends on how often you buy and how much you spend. You can build up points and you print off your uh, coupons and you have a coupon code. So if you order online or if you take it to your dermatologist office, you know, you can get quite a bit of money off on the end price. And if you get uh, Juvederm or Botox, you also built up points. I have not, <laughs> I have not had Botox in probably a year and a half and I seriously need to get some, or it's probably been about a year actually. Um, I do enjoy it from time to time, but I also, I kind of have a love hate relationship with Botox and I'm very open and honest. If I ever had something done, I would tell you guys, I have no problem about that. But the thing about Botox for me, I love the way my forehead looks and it softens this line here. The thing I don't like about it and what prevents me from getting it more uh, is it brings my eyebrows up like Spock. And I already have eyebrows that are naturally, I guess because of my ethnicity, I have these eyebrows that are very Greek-like and um, you know, I don't want them just pointing straight up. And so that's why I don't really get Botox very often occasionally. And I've been thinking, hey, maybe I need some in here. But um, if I did, I would probably, I don't know, you know, I guess it would depend on how many units you get, but you get uh, points and it does add up to quite a bit. Sometimes you can get as much as $50 off your products. And uh, so if you are interested in the Skin Medica line, um, definitely sign up for the Brilliant Distinctions program because you will save quite a bit of money, especially if you're like me and you use these products religiously. Now, this video has ran a little bit longer than I thought it would. Um, because I could talk all day long about skincare, so I think what I'll do is maybe do another video sometime showing the makeup products that I get and you know how I apply them. Not that I'm an expert because I am not, but you guys have been asking me and I want to give you guys the kind of content that you like to see on my channel. We can't just review bags all day, <laughs> but um, I do find uh, skincare one of the most important things to me because like I said, you need a really nice canvas before you put the makeup on and I feel like it is just so important to take care of your skin. There's one other item that I get at Walmart and I forgot to tell you guys about. Now before I use the cleanser, I will take just a little um, uh, cotton round and I love this microcellular water and I'll put a few drops on a cotton round and this will take off most of your makeup. And then I go in with a small amount of my uh, Skin Medica facial cleanser and cleanse my face the rest of the way. I don't use a toner or anything like that. I pretty much sometimes I will even after I've cleansed my face, get another cotton round and just kind of go back over it. But uh, once you use this and the cleanser, you have a really clean uh, face. So um, this one is the all-in-one mattifying, removes makeup, cleanses, and purifies your pores. And there are other uh, kinds um, of the microcellular water and I just really particularly like this one. So I do use this. So that is really all I do for skincare. I think I will probably go for a facial um, very soon. I have not had a facial um, in, my goodness, it's been a while. It's been over a year. And I think it's probably been close to a year and a half since I've had any Botox. Um, you know, I just don't, um, like, like I said, I don't really like the way it pulls my eyes, my eyebrows up like that. But, um, but if you do, if you are into that and you, you're interested in these products, definitely, definitely sign up for the Brilliant Distincts 
distinctions program. Okay, so I hope that you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, just uh, send them below, send them to me. Uh, you can also email me at yotastyle1 at gmail and I will definitely respond to your emails. And um, if you liked this video and you're not a subscriber, please subscribe and also click the thumbs up and the notification bell. So until next time guys, bye-bye.